I'm recording. Hi. I'm Charles Walker. <laughs> Welcome to Yuma, Arizona. Right now, I'm gonna take you around the neighborhood and show you what uh, what this West Coast feel is like. Uh, so just take a trip with me and let's check them out. As you can see all around the neighborhood, it's like it's got a real Pueblo look. You know what I mean? Like like what the Indians used to live in. So just come on. outside the gate here and come on. Let's go. Give them a shot around the neighborhood and show them what it looks like. Zoom in and all that. Zoom out. Let's go. Our house. 1835F. Nothing unusual in the mail, just regular bills and shit. You know, um, from that wreck I got in back in back in 2009 on the way home, it was snowing real bad, and I fucking was driving too fast for the weather, and I got in a wreck. So it's still hassling me about that. Let's go. <laughs> Get a shot of that. y'all can see it's real it's, it's quiet as a motherfucking church mouse out here um make sure you're not covering up the microphone cold. come on mm, And the purpose of this fence this it's just to give it a more more homely feel like you know coming through the fence in the yard like a, almost like a picket fence you know what i'm saying come on concrete wall now the biggest thing about yuma is uh first thing people will tell you about arizona and all these southwestern states is uh is the heat down here it's a real dry heat <clears throat> if you look at my face you can see the sun is shining directly in my face but ain't no sweat buds on my head you may see a little bit of dew but that's only because we got like six percent humidity at the most down here but other than that i mean it's it's nice weather in the evenings it hasn't really gotten over 97 degrees down here yet so Excellent. i ain't seen nothing 108 108 yeah, our first two days here was 108. Oh, okay. Well, I, I didn't feel that. Like I said, it's a dry heat, so it may be 108 degrees, but it's, it, it feels like 85, so, you know, it's not that bad. I think I'm going to really like it out here. I can't wait to hit up Phoenix and San Diego and, you know, Las Vegas and get down to what happens in Vegas, stays in Vegas. No. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, <laughs> well uh, how you liking you, Mom? I like you. I like it a lot. It's a lot bigger than I thought. As yeah, far I think, as the I city. Think we was misled. 
a lot of folks was telling us, hey man, you ain't gonna like Yuma. Yuma's real small. It was talking about the actual base. This town is like the size of Val Austin, maybe a little bit. Bigger than Val Austin. It's bigger than Val Austin. It's a lot, it's a lot to do. And I'm gonna show y'all some more video footage on that later on, probably this weekend. I'm gonna take y'all downtown with the camera and, and show you what kind of setup they got. It's real, real nice. Incredible outdoor mall. Yeah, it's, it's not a gang, y'all. Um, shit. Mountains. Yeah, mountains. Yeah, yeah, yeah it's, it's so much I haven't shown y'all, but everything, like our neighbor's fighting right now. Um, Nicole, if you want to turn the count. Anyways, um. Is that shots? Anyways. I'm gonna show y'all some more footage later on with all the mountains in the background. Take them in the back. Rolling mountains. Yeah, let's go in the backyard. Cheyenne's Park is back here. She seems to be convinced that we purchased this park for her and her only, being that it's right outside of our gate. This is our backyard. Yeah, it's surrounded by a brick wall. Let me show y'all something. Like, the West Coast is real big on these walls, right? Now, I'm going to take y'all back to the movie Menace of Society, right? Y'all remember that time they was in the alley they were shooting dice and shit? Let me, I'm going to show y'all something. Y'all going to know exactly what I'm talking about. But they real big on these right here. You remember the time when uh, in Menace of Society? <laughs> in Menace of Society when AWACS was on the wall. He was like, you ready for this? <laughs> he was like, shit, one time. And they jumped off and stuff. That's that's why they, they build shit like this, man. Keep the cops. This is the park right here. One of probably 20. This is Cheyenne's park. Her park all by herself. I come out here with them during the day and sit. Me, Cheyenne, Aeneas, and the dog. Real nice. If it's not too hot. Well, I mean, they got a canopy up over this thing, so, you know, it blocks direct sun heat, sunlight, but it don't do much, nothing for the heat itself, you know what I mean? So, I guess it serves the purpose, half of it anyways. But uh, I hope y'all enjoyed the footage and, and all that shit. So, like I said, I'm going to hit y'all up with some more footage later on this week. Show y'all what's really happening out here in Yuma. And we out. Peace.